We should rummage through this area. If someone lived here, it must have been in a drier place. Look at this cave. It is a good place for an old man to settle.
Some people have lived. But we will have to look further if we want to see the Let's see if you can ward off this fate! This is a cave of knowledge, or at least it looks like one. The old man must have been exceptional to be able to live in such a place. Let's take a closer look at these paintings. We may learn something from them. This mural is very ancient. It depicts an old man dressed as a priest, getting his face painted by a masked native. This mural is very ancient. It depicts an old man dressed as a priest, getting his face painted by a masked native. This mural depicts an old man praying in front of a face in the mountain. He's holding a rosary. <sighs> Saint Matthias, praying to Enon Milfrichtemann. I do not know these glyphs, but these spirals are native symbols. There are some words in our ancient language next to them. The light and the earth are the two faces of a same power. It's impossible to know if this is a translation or another sentence. But this is a message that would seriously displease the Inquisitors. I cannot believe it. These symbols, they are signs used in the secret writing of the Donegada. Engraved tablets. They resemble the ones we recovered in Eden. We should take them with us. The researchers would be delighted to study them. It looks like a chaplet made of pewter. It's rather basic, but it was made a long time ago. And it undeniably comes from the continent. I seem to recall that Saint Matthias is almost always depicted using a similar rosary. The 
are some native symbols here and some letters I recognize. As if someone had tried to write in the native language using our alphabet. Men dwi stad en on mil frigt. It means welcome us amongst your people, en on mil frigtemen. This is incredible. Saint Matthias would have known about the spirit of the island and would have prayed to him. So that's what it was. The priest's old sage became a Donegad. I don't think that they'll be happy about that. And yet, it could bring peace. The Solasser will no longer be able to burn our people and our guardians. Why is he not depicted wearing the marks of the Donegada? It was a very long time ago. Magic had not yet been given to us by Enon Mil Flichtemann. I wonder what I should do with these relics. Eugenia probably didn't imagine that Saint Matthias lived his life in a way that's so different from what they advocate. As for Virgil, he wasn't wrong. Such a revelation will certainly cause a schism in Teleme. I know how difficult keeping some secrets can be, and this one is huge. It could lead to peace with the natives as much as it could lead to a civil war. I already took sides in their quarrel. If I change my mind, I'm afraid that it might be seen as treason. I'll think about it on the way there. Let's go back to the researchers' camp. <laughs>